and ended up get gaining immortality by uh and the first thing she does with it is kill people well she gains immortality by her soul moving into a random female's body a random young girl's body so when that girl dies her soul moves to the next girl and to the next girl and it's been happening for a millennia so remember that one time you found a knife on the floor i think <laughs> the edge of that never really left it never, okay, okay, so here we go. Here is starting this. So, we're going to see these two, like, do their best from both their games. You know, so yeah. far, like, yeah, I, he's just afraid. I uh -huh. think already Haru has made Angry Dad afraid. Well, so Haru's doing a really good job putting a lot of pressure on. Yeah. Like, right there, honestly, I feel like Angry Dad should have just let it be. He should just have hang, hang waited out, out yeah. and blocked instead of trying to do yeah. anything else. Well, a lot of the time, Bucks was blocking like a lot of his mix-ups because of the fact that he was, you know, just yeah. waiting. Because it doesn't like it's really... Unless she starts out with something kind of crazy, it's like a lot of her stack yep. isn't going to be... And, and you're seeing out. Haro really utilize uh, the charge for the, for the grid there. Yeah, which is a good idea because he has to stand back and just wait. So why not just get Bar to keep an offense going once you get in? Yeah. So it's always a good idea to do that in this game. But now, Angry Dad has an offense. He just blew up that meter spending. And he just used some more for more grid. Yeah. If he can last a little bit longer, Angry Dad will get some of that grid back. But it looks like he's just going to get hit. And he may actually lose that chance. No, he'll get, he'll get, nope, he'll he'll get, get the chance. Yeah. But let's see. What's he going to do? Okay, good idea. Um, if he knows if he knows that he using the grid combos. Okay. 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 All right. That was a good closeout. Yes. That was a good idea. Very good. Just get the win. Yeah. Because that could have been bad if he dropped it. If he got him another get an opportunity. Oh, oh, that was oh, that was a really good idea. I think he just missed something. He he just barely missed space it. Yeah. Uh, that was that's uh that's yeah. her command grab. Cross up. Um and uh, yeah. her super version of it does do that jump in. So just barely missed space, but that, yeah, that gave Haru this l heavy lead here. Yeah, I know. This is this is this is fantastic. He's out. that's such a good mix-up. Oh wow. Yeah, he can really please turn Haru and that Mika over. Oh, but Mika's low tier, dude. He's just gonna punch <laughs> her into the sky and then bring her back down. Again, this is an anime fighter. Even if they're low tier, you can never count them out. You really can. Like, these games are actually really well balanced. Well, we don't even know what tier Lin's in. Chat, what tier is Lin A in? If anyone knows. Let's see what people have to say. I hope so. Alright, so anyway, second next game. Haru taking a down. Okay, that's a good answer here. That's a good answer for that. Alright, this is some good stagger pressure too. Just making just checking him, see so if he's pressing any buttons. Two overheads? Interesting. Yeah, no. Mark has actually, Mark is actually, Angry Dad, is ac actually has great stagger pressure. Like, this is actually really good so far. Okay, this is where it goes downhill. Because it looks like he just, he's just not, okay, he actually fucked the cross up, but I think he thought he was plus. But it looks like it may not have been, ooh. That's still so tricky, because it can go on either side. Alright, he got, he got his offense. He's, he's still keeping that thing going. Oh, man, he should have committed to that. That mid? Alright, that mid. Alright, so technically this should be in Lin's favor. Yeah. But yeah, it looks it looks okay. It looks like once he starts bullying her, it's actually pretty good. And that's I remember he DP'd him like one time it didn't work, and now Mark and now Angry Dad just does not feel like DPing him at all. Maybe it's a good idea, but like it just lets him That's a good answer. So I think Oh, right when I say it. So like, hey, make him think about it. Make him think about starting an offense, at least. All right, that was interesting. That just crossed him up like that. So like, all right, this is actually a lot more even than it looks. It's just that when he gets hit, he gets screwed up. He's basically playing Dragon Ball. Oh, that that two L sucks. Ooh, he got the hit. He's taking him over there. He's starting something again. Why is he crossing him up? Like. I don't understand this. People should always be carrying people to the corner. I think no matter what, you should always be carrying someone to the corner. It always gets you so much in these games. Right. So close in this game anyways. Yeah. 
like 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 we said, like any character can deal with any other character in most enemy fighters right now. There's not anyone like super dominant. Like, what's a good example? Like Kokonoe was in Chrono Phantasm. That's such a good TP. All right, what's he gonna do? All right, I think that was doing that on wake up was probably just like, okay, what's this guy doing? Let's adjust accordingly. Yeah, that's so. That is so good. All right, Angry Dad taking the second game. He is fighting for his life, and he's doing a very good job of it. The worst character is in Evil Tag. Yeah, I know. Lynn's probably the worst. At least up there in BB Tag. But she's good in this game. And heck, we're in day like negative. We're in day negative 12. That yeah. tier list could change very quickly. So look, I'm just doing a quick kind of look across a few of these uh, people's tier lists here. And honestly, this game is pretty well balanced. Everyone's this about insane, almost all. Like, I'm looking at those tier list charts. And uh, Seth and Phonon seem to filter Holy to the top quite a bit. Yeah. But then everyone else is right around the middle. Um, slight differences here there, but then... So there's definitely a best, but... Yeah. But yeah. then Mika and Enkidu fall to the bottom pretty heavily. Oh, okay. From whatever, from what I'm looking around. Yeah. Okay, so. he bodied him in that, in that Yeah. Round. We didn't even have to say anything about it. <laughs> it was just such a blowout. Alright. Okay, got an offense start. This is actually either way, then. Because, like, they've actually been doing a really good job of just mixing each other up. Alright. Getting these hits in. Yep. That's actually not a bad reset. Just keep her yeah. out. Baharu building up that uh, grid there. Oh, absolutely. But, like, the, the big thing is, is, like, if you don't let her get in the first place, it's not that bad. And then, like, I think Link can play a better mid-game mid than... than uh, mid oh, that was... That sucks. He should attack that. This is gonna hurt. Whoa! Oh, that call out there! That's so disrespectful. Yo, he deserves... Okay. All right, Haru, you won this. He, you definitely won this. This is, this is, ooh, all right. Ops to not spend the meter there. Oh, that mix up. That's so disrespectful. Yo, ah. man. And Haru takes I, it. I wonder how he feels about that. 